action because the Agenda 2030 provides uh, the framework for uh, holistic, I would say, integrated uh, and cohesive and coherent approach to sustainable development. And honestly, uh, the social dimension uh, of sustainable development is present in almost every sustainable development goal. Rethinking and strengthening social development in the contemporary world, that will be the main theme of this year's discussions of the Commission on Social Development. This year the Commission for Social Development will meet just a few months after the adoption of the 2030 Agenda and of course um, social development themes are very much at the core of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. The Commission will take place during the first two weeks of February. Uh, it is critical to focus on uh, the social perspective of the Sustainable Development Goals. <laughs> The fact that there is no one-size-fits-all policy when you are talking about social development. However, there is always best practices and good examples that uh, policymakers should embrace, should indeed adopt. The session will have three panel discussions focusing on various issues related to social development, such as implementation, emerging issues and inclusion of persons with disabilities. People with disabilities are mentioned 11 times in the Sustainable Development 2030 Agenda. So it is ambitious that the Commission for Social Development has a very important role to play when it comes to the implementation and monitoring of this agenda, taking into account that the agenda uh, focuses on no leaving anyone behind, no leaving people with disabilities behind. Successful social development policies need to be evidence-based and they need to be data-driven in order to make progress towards um, the 17 goals and 169 targets you need to be able to track this progress in a meaningful way in addition to the high level panel discussions there will be over 30 side events organized by the civil society as this is the policy year the commission will adopt final reports on the main theme as well as on the emerging issues if you believe that social development is talking about enabling people, enabling populations to contribute positively in their societies, then we uh, should agree that a quality education system uh, most probably will ensure indeed a social policy, a social development that addresses inequality, addresses uh, poverty eradication, uh, employment and social inclusion. 2016 is important because it's the first year of the implementation process. So uh, the way we begin this implementation could, uh, could be, uh, let's say, the way to, to lead the process for the next 15 years. That's why the CISOG meeting now, uh, in its policy year, the 54th session, it's so important. A development framework that is people-centered can only succeed if it embraces a social dimension of sustainable development goals. This is because people are and must remain the focus of global, national and local development efforts.